December is certainly going to be a very busy month in our city, so we've got Jennifer Hansen from Downtown Indy in studio today. We want to talk about all the big events. It's always good to have you Thank here. Thank you. Of course, we have to start with the Big Ten Championship, which is uh, this weekend. We're going to have thousands of football fans in town. What is there for them to do? Well, for all the fans coming down, Friday and Saturday, you could head to the convention center. They have a fan fest um, that both days. And then on Saturday, you'll want to head to Georgia Street for a tailgate party. It begins at uh, 10 in the morning, and it goes right up to the game time at 8 p.m. And last year, there was a lot of excitement around that uh, fan fest yes. and the Georgia Street activities. Absolutely. Thousands of people, right? Thousands of people come downtown. Whether they have tickets or not, they right. want to be a part. Um, they're just hanging out in the restaurants and the bars and on Georgia Street. It's, it's a ton of fun. And, of course, this is the uh, venue, the uh, Lucas Oil Stadium for the Big Ten Championship, which is Wisconsin against Penn State. Saturday night at 8 o'clock. No tickets available on Ticketmaster, though I imagine that a lot of fans are still going to be looking for tickets sure. trying to come in for that. All right, so next week there's really something cool taking place at the Indiana State Museum. It's a Wonderful Life. Yes, we have a great partnership with the IMAX Theater at the State Museum, and they'll show It's a Wonderful Life one time only, 6.15 p.m. on Tuesday. And what's great is a dollar of every ticket will come back to downtown beautification. Wow. So we would get a chance to see Jimmy Stewart up on the uh, right. big screen at the IMAX. That'd be really cool. So that's next Tuesday. And there's this opportunity for some Christmas shopping. Yelp's totally bizarre. What's that all about? Um, they do a great job. It's Thursday the 8th at the library. It starts at 6.30 p.m. All right. Now, you want to RSVP on Yelp this week um, so you can get in. But they have more than 150 local vendors there. Um, so everything from Circle of Lights, you'll see some, uh, I, I bought something last year that was really cool, to food, to right. local wares, it's really fun. Okay, so that's next Thursday, and of course, a lot of us really love coming downtown to Indianapolis to go to the Yuletide celebration, and that's getting underway again. Right, there's tons of performances downtown, the Yuletide starts this week, running all through December. The IRT has um, their Christmas uh, play every year. Mm -hmm. You can go to the theaters on Mass Ave where they show a Christmas story. Uh, the ballet is headed to, or the Nutcracker is at the Murat. So tons of performances happening this month. And, and obviously, once you pick a show that you want to go to, then do some shopping there at <laughs> Circle Center. You get your photo taken on Monument Circle, I mean, with the lights up right. now on the monument. So that's always fun. And, of course, we don't want to push ahead too soon because we <laughs> want to enjoy everything about Christmas. But New Year's Eve is also going to be something uh, pretty cool here in downtown Indianapolis as it's right. been. We hope that you mark your calendars for December 31st because uh, downtown Indy Inc.'s New Year's Eve um, on Georgia Street is happening again. And we'll have, uh, again, an Indy car hoisted above and for everyone to see, and at midnight, that will be our ball drop. Yeah. You need to put somebody up in the, uh, in the car. I'm happy to do it. <laughs> I think that'd be kind of an interesting ride, of be. course. Fireworks, and uh, that's a really fun event there on Georgia Street. And you've got a fundraiser for a beautification fund that we wanted to talk about. Right. What's all that that's about? That's going on right now, and I'm just thinking, wow, we should add that uh, being in the race car to the auction. But <laughs> <laughs> there's a lot of great gifts that you can bid on through next Tuesday. It basically ends right after the movie shows at 10 p.m., okay. Okay. But we've got tickets to the Pacers, Colts game. You can be an honorary flag starter uh, for an IMS practice day. Really? All right. We have one of the sold-out Circle of Lights ornaments. We have three of those that are only available yeah, you're in the right. auction. Those all sold out. That's yes. right. That would be a good opportunity to get that. So okay, some great so we'll, gifts. We'll put all of that information uh, from uh, downtown Indy.